be more productive there. And uh, King really took ownership of that, and they all took a little bit of ownership of that and said, you know, we're, we're going to make this better. And obviously, I think we blocked a lot better after that game as well. But then King really took off uh, Indiana State, Southern Illinois, uh, and then he really gained the lion's share of the reps, uh, at least of the carries from there on. But uh, we still feel really good about the other guys we have, and, and I like the fact that we can put three guys out there in, in kind of our, what we call our rockets or machines package. And, um, I think it causes some problems for all of us. When you say King's running harder, what does that mean? I mean, running harder. Like, well, no, I just think he's running with more of a purpose yeah. as far as he's not getting knocked down on that first contact. You know, some of the runs he had, uh, I think back even the Southern Illinois game, where he ended up, he got two yards on that thing, but he was really hit behind the line of scrimmage five or six yards. Youngstown was the same way. And he just was able to always get that first guy not to go bring him down. And, and uh, uh, it's something that I just think, not only that, but, and, and King and I had a good talk. I have a tremendous amount of respect for him. It's hard to do that when you're getting eight, nine carries. And then we started upping it to 12 to 15 to 18. Now he's a 15 to 20 carry guy. Yeah, uh, I've been around, as a, I've been down here as a young guy, you know, and then I had the chance to see the older guys, how they prepared for this game, you know, the things they did. And now that I'm older, um, I'm able to share some of that experience with the younger guys, you know, walk them through the process, you know, let them know that we're down here to play a football game, just not to be enjoying all this. But, um, you know, my experience is definitely, it's going to play a huge part in uh, this week. One thing you guys do well, um, you know how to put them away. Tell me about that. Why, why are you so good at the program doing that? Um, I think that's what a lot of that comes from our offense. You know, uh, we like to run the football, so you know, regardless of where we're now, we're going to run the football. And uh, when we do get up, unfortunately for the other team, we like to run the football. So I mean, the other team takes a beat, and we start doing that. Sure. A big thing from Crockett, in just his hard work, and I mean, Crockett was a little bit of a crazy fool sometimes, but I think King takes that well. Yep. Is there a? Um, uh, have you seen him run harder this year as the season's gone on? Have you blocked him, blocking for him? 100%. Uh, yeah. Our whole running back crew has gotten better throughout the season. I would say from the first game to the middle of the season to now, there's been drastic steps in the way they run, the, the effort they throw behind every run. I got plenty of It's just, it's unbelievable. Yeah. And uh, just going through it all together, and it's really surreal, and it's a great family to be a part of. It means so much. Uh, I mean, this this is my final career game as college athlete. Um, I I can't. I mean, I can be humble and stuff as much as I can be, but I I really want it. I want it bad. I want to win. Uh, I just want to end on a great note. Uh, along those same lines, how good has this underclassman group been for you guys? Uh, We've been, they've been good. Uh, they've been picking up on things. Uh, the defensive tackles, young defensive tackles, come up to me asking me what kind of blocks they're seeing and stuff. Sometimes they don't know the name of it, so I have to kind of figure it out in between. But they're a class that has a lot of promise. They're very athletic kids. Uh, I mean, you'll see it with the DBs like uh, like Dom, uh, and then you got Merck. And you get some of those young guys going, and it's it's pretty cool watching them, but uh, they ask so many questions. They want to know as much as they can about what what can they do. To Passing game goals. How would you like to improve for this game? I think just playing faster is really what it comes down to. Is is playing faster and trusting what I'm seeing, and and then just doing it. You know, not thinking as much, and that's really eliminate the thinking and, and just play as fast as I can. Appreciate it. I always had a ton of support from my family. There was no question about that. Um, always cared a lot about me, and always had the things that I needed. Um, it was never an issue. Uh, yeah, you know, it made me kind of work a little harder. I don't know, really, with the chip on my shoulder, but just, you know, just gave me a little extra motivation to make a name for myself. So uh, it's good to see what uh, hard work kind of paid off. First off, how's it feel to be back here? Oh, it feels great. I mean, uh, for, I just remember the first time I came, I, I was amazed at, you know, one, how good the food was. Absolutely amazing. But two, I mean, how many fans come down? It's just, it's impressive that we have that great of a fan base, and that's what's great about coming down here, is just because you get to enjoy all that stuff. So.